Hey, before this video starts, I just want to mention, if you want to commission me for a video posted here on YouTube, come over to when I stream either here on YouTube or on Twitch at Retro Mario Twitch. But, let me not take up your time, enjoy the video. Extra... EXTRA! There you are. <laughs> you were supposed to be awake not even an hour ago. So what took you so long to wake up? Oh, is that your excuse, huh? I want you to look real close at me, and make sure you're paying attention. Do I look like the type of person who wants laziness in their group? ANSWER THE QUESTION! That's what I thought. Now get up! You think I give a rat's ass that you're trying to get dressed? Just hurry up and get dressed already. Jesus. You new recruits are a lot more annoying nowadays. You know that? Well, I'm sick and tired of these new recruits thinking they can do whatever the hell they want and not listen to the boss. Newsflash. You listen to me. No one else. What was that? No, 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 no. You want to be a smartass, speak up. I'm listening now. <laughs> you think I'm crazy, huh? You haven't seen NOTHING YET! <laughs> oh, now I'm a psychopath. You think this hurts me? <laughs> I've dealt with a lot more pain than just this. You are nothing in comparison of what I felt, of what I feel. You're nothing but a pathetic dog following orders, like they're supposed to. And sometimes when those pathetic dogs want to get a little bit mouthy, the owner has to get rather rough with them, to show them discipline. And obviously, I have to show you more discipline and put you in your place. <laughs> right. Are you listening now, Extra? Because you have a job to do today. It's a robbery. You're gonna have a team with you, but... Your team is also a group of the new recruits. Obviously, you've been around a little bit more than the other ones have, so you're in charge of the whole operation. Wow. 
Why? Because I said so, damn it. Unless you don't want to be a part of our team. You know what happened to the last guy who said that they wanted to stop working with us, right? Oh, well, I love telling this story, so I'll tell you myself. You see, the last guy that went through all the trouble of saying that they don't want to work with us anymore... The day that they decided to walk out of the building, let's just say a few of our uh, helpers took care of him the way that he should be treated. Because clearly he wasn't man enough nor strong enough to be a part of our organization. So four of our goons took him in the back of a dark alley and put a few shells in between his skull. Now, you don't want to end up like that old bastard now, do you? So I suggest you listen when you're spoken to. And don't! Talk out of line. Otherwise, you'll have the same fate. I make myself clear. Now, before that whole story took place, like I was saying, you're in charge of a whole heist that's coming up today. It's a shipyard. There's a lot of stuff that we need inside of one of those containers. Mostly technology and weaponry, but some of it is a little bit more loose cash and whatnot. Obviously, you goons will have whatever is left over of the cash, but the technology and weaponry will be hauled back here. And obviously, you're gonna have to split it among yourselves, so you could do the math on that. No, I don't want the money. I could care less about the money. It's the weaponry and technology that we really need. Me, and the other boss as well. Oh. Speak of the devil. He's calling me. What's up? Mm-hmm. Yeah, don't worry. I just woke them up. They're late. But I already talked to them about that. And set them straight. Uh-huh. All right. See you in a few. Well. It looks like uh, the other boss wants to have a chat with you. After I'm done with you here. But that is your mission today. Oh, I think the new shipment should come around midnight or so, a little bit later after that. So make sure you take the goons and the new recruits over by the shipyard before that time happens. Otherwise, you're going to miss your window of opportunity. And again... If you try to talk back to me, try to make yourself the bigger person. I will personally make sure that your face looks like mine by 
Titan Fold. Do I make myself clear to you? Dog. Good. Well, well, well. Look who's here. <laughs> Have fun with your chat. I'm going now. So, what made you think that you can wake up right now after everything? Hmm. I don't want to hear it. You know exactly what you signed up for when you joined us. It's a long, strenuous road before you can get to any type of stature that me and Bakugo are at. Not a lot of people understand that, and we have to put them in their place because of that. And I don't want to do that to you. Well, if it isn't obvious, I have a little bit more morals than Bakugo. And clearly, you made him so pissed off that he made his whole face in just that one mere second. It takes a lot to piss him off like that. You're just a bad listener. And that's all I'm hearing from that. But I want you to make sure that your ears are open when you're talking to me. Because I won't just yell at you for your ignorance. I'll kill you if you don't listen to me. So, I'm pretty sure Bakugo has already told you about your mission. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Now, all you have to do now is just wait. That's a real easy job for you. Waiting. Wasting time. Hmm? You know the saying, time is money, right? That means very, that means something. That means something very, very important to me. You see, if you waste my time and everyone else's time, that's money being lost. And I know my associate doesn't really care about the money. But I do. How do you think we keep all of this? Hmm? How do you think we keep everything in order and check? It's not with brute strength or anything like that. No, it's the money. The money that comes in with every shipment, every heist, everything is surrounded by money. I overheard Bakugo screaming about you guys splitting the money. But you're always going to be splitting that money with me as well. Do you think... Do you think I give a rat's ass what he says? That's my money. Not just yours. Get that through your thick, fucky 
Catholic school. You guys get a percentage while I get the rest. Do I make myself clear to you? Good. <sighs> the things I hate in this world and its ignorance is at the tippy top of that list. I do not want to see you die because of your ignorance. You're a good person. I can see that in you. But acting like this, you're going to get yourself killed, either from me or from Bakugo, or from any other douchebag in this city. There's a lot of things in this world that want to kill you. I'm one of them. He's one of them. So straighten up that whole attitude of yours and make sure you're on time with everything that you do. Because if you're not on time, things go south. And then it's your ass who's going to be swimming in the ocean with the fishes. Oh, you think I'm joking? <laughs> Just yesterday, I had to kill one of the goons with my own hands. And only my hands. Afterwards, I threw him in the body bag and threw him into the ocean with a few cinder blocks in the bag as well. The cops had no idea who that person was after I was done with them. So, I don't think you want to end up in the ocean, do you? Because I don't think you're a good enough swimmer to survive. After I'm done with you. That's more like it. Now. You know your job. And you know what you have to do. Oh. One more thing. I give you full permission to kill anybody who talks out of line to you. Why? Well, you're going to be the whole boss of this whole situation. It's best to take authority in the best way possible. So you have my full permission to kill any of the goons and new recruits who wanna backstab us or just talk back to you? I promise you're not gonna get in trouble with me or Bakugo. I'll even tell him myself personally that I gave you that permission. That's a good dog. Midnight. Don't forget it. And don't be late. Alright then. Oh, and afterwards you're done with that. I would like to speak to you. Not like this in your 
own personal room. I want you to come to my office after you're done. To have more of a personal talk. You feel me? <laughs> Good. Remember, midnight. See you soon.